the field of a square pair of coils can be found by using the bo savar law. Here are our square coils, each with 50 turns and sides of length 45 centimeters. The axial magnetometer probe is mounted on this carriage to record the Z component of magnetic field. Before we apply current to the coils, we have compensated for the small part of the Earth's magnetic field that is in the horizontal direction by zeroing the magnetometer. The Earth's magnetic field is essentially vertical with a strength of about a half a gauss and could contribute a slight error to the measurement if not accounted for. A current of two and a half amperes is applied to the coils. We have placed the theoretical variation of the magnetic field versus position Z as a solid line directly on the oscilloscope screen. Let's see if the scope trace follows this theoretical curve. We have adjusted the scope vertical gain so that the display matches the theoretical waveform at one position. We'll see if the scope trace follows the shape of this theoretical curve. We'll check the field magnitude later. The probe is initially here. We now turn on the probe carriage. The scope horizontal gain has been adjusted so that the horizontal deflection of the scope matches the Z position of the probe. The magnetic field is largest directly under a coil. Now the left one at Z equal minus D. and is fairly uniform in the central region between coils, with a minimum at the center, Z equals zero. The field increases again to a maximum under the right coil at Z equal D. and decreases in the region outside the coils. Now the magnetic field is an odd function around z equals zero. It is zero in the center as expected. This reversing switch reverses the direction of current in the left coil. Let's see how the measured field compares with the prediction. We have aligned the zero field lines and adjusted the vertical gain to match the waveform at one point. We now turn on the probe carriage. The field is a negative maximum under the left coil. is zero at the center and reaches a positive maximum under the right coil.